It's not that easy being green. <laughs> 751 on a Friday. Good morning, everybody. And we know the green movement is all the rage, but what does it really mean to go green? Well, one local dermatologist has completely transformed his office into a space that is completely environmentally friendly. Good to mama earth. And he's here to tell us how we can do it too. Please welcome Dr. Stefan Weiss of the Weiss Skin Institute here with us now. Good morning, Dr. Weiss. How you doing? Good. How are you? Thank I'm you for wonderful. Me. Oh my gosh. Thanks for waking up early with us. <laughs> I appreciate it. Okay. So your office this is very green. Yes. And but it, when you walk in, does it look any different? Not at all. It looks like any other standard medical office, except for the fact that everything that uh, was involved in putting it together uh, is environmentally friendly, from the floors to the paint to the cabinetry. Uh, it really takes on the next level that I look at in terms of an environmental office. Uh, the one part that would be different from any other traditional doctor's office is it's paperless. It's so, paperless. So when I walk in to see a patient, I don't walk in with a chart. They actually go in and just say, hello, Mrs. Smith, how are you today? And everything is on the computer. Okay. Uh, from the initial introduction uh, to the final prescription that gets faxed directly to the pharmacy, uh, there's no paper that goes through uh, in the office itself. This so. is pretty extreme green then. This, I just <laughs> feel like no paper is like, <gasps> what? No paper? Right. Yeah, so it's, it's but, definitely uh, a challenge and, and definitely different for a lot of patients. Absolutely. We're used to having a chart and used to being able to say, can you pull that or something of that nature. We don't do any of that in the office. Okay, we have a picture of your office actually. I'm, uh, let's oh, check this sure. out. Um, so do your, when you come up with no paper, your patients, I'm sure, are like, uh, are you going to write anything down? Down. But oh, it looks nice. So break it down for us. Explain what you did exactly to, to be kind to Mama Earth. Uh, so the first thing was they use a renewable flooring. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to get flooring uh, that comes from certifiable, sustainable forests. Uh, and so what we used is bamboo uh, for that. Bamboo. Uh, all of the paint is low VOC or low volatile organic compound, so it doesn't emit a lot of the odors okay. uh, that traditional paint would do. The cabinets are all done from recycled materials. Mm -hmm. uh, so in that part, it was nice. And because the office was refurbished, what we did was rather than just trashing everything that came out of the old office when we rebuilt it, uh, a lot of it was donated so that the old cabinets could be reused uh, in other spaces. Oh, wow, that's fantastic. So how much did all of this cost and how much, what's the investment like? like how much energy are we actually saving here? Uh, it's actually very minimal in terms of the cost. So uh, the EMR, the electronic medical record, is probably the largest uh, cost part of it. Uh, so the outlay for that uh, is about $15,000, which is more than buying a couple of manila folders at your local office supply store. Okay. Uh, but in the long run, what I'm doing is saving a lot of space. Uh, so clearly what we have is rather than taking up the space over the years that an office would exist, uh, you put the money up front to go electronic and then you save that in the back end. Okay, because I know uh, a lot of people I've heard, they think it's too expensive to go green and kind of take, you know, transform everything, but you're saying right. it's feasible and it's worth it. Right, it's definitely feasible and it's clearly worth it. I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, think about what we just saw last by your own weatherman, where in 2009 we set a record temperature for 89 degrees and now we're in the 40s. I mean, clearly the environment is being affected by everything we do. Right. Uh, and if we can take the opportunity to spend a few extra dollars now to save that later on, uh, it really will make a tremendous impact uh, for both us and future generations. Okay, last question, Dr. Weiss. If someone wants to go green and transform their office, where do they start? Uh, I think the first place to start is finding a good electronic medical record system uh, that meets their needs. Uh, and then as they look to rebuild or refurbish, to, to go just to your Home, home Depot or Lowe's okay. uh, and purchase things that are environmentally friendly materials. Dr. Weiss, thank you for being here. Oh, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Good luck on your New Year's resolutions, by the way. <laughs> for more tips on making your space green or to learn more about the Weiss Skin Institute, it's very easy. Just visit southflorida.com. Click on the Go button. 7.55 now. Hey, Dave, what's up? Hi, Chris.